What's going on YouTube? So today I want to show you a few packages that I bought on Black Friday. Well, pre-Black Friday anyways. Uh, Ball Creek Supply is having a 30% uh, off sale. So picked up a few things. I probably ordered like four or five different orders just as each day went on. I ordered two or three things here and so forth. So uh, also ordered on Amazon. So let's get into it. I uh, pre-opened the packages, but I haven't peeked yet. So just so you guys know, that's why they're open. This one is Ball Creek Supply. I kind of almost forgot what I already ordered because this stuff came in Friday and today is Sunday, so. Okay. Alright, package one. We got, oh, yeah. Nice. Okay, so I ordered the flipper magnet but they sent me two yes I, I think it's two anyways I don't think I don't think they shipped two two of them there are two parts in uh, two separate packages so that is pretty cool no okay no here it is right here sweet so we got a uh, two for the price of one not intentionally either it was an accident From Amazon, all right. From Amazon, we got a bunch of packing material. And, yeah, uh, JBO DCP 5000. And this is going to be the return pump for this tank here that I'm going to show you here in a minute. All right. And as you can see, one of the last ones uh, this is a uh, Agro, Agro Bright, uh, I think it's a. Uh, General Hydroponics, a uh, T5 light, 48 inch, uh, six bulbs. Whoa. Oh, there's bulbs in here. Huh. So here's some bulbs. I'm gonna set these down just to be safe. Alright. And for the fixture, this is a mess. As you can tell, there's some manuals and stuff in there. I'll get that later. I just want to uh, get the actual fixture out. You guys see what it looks like. And this is the back side you're seeing right here, so it's not the front. Throw this junk over here. Get it out of the way. Okay. So this is the back. Got these little hangers built in right here because I'm going to hang it up. There it is. So, one, two, three, four, five, five. yep, six bulbs. Uh, six bulbs. I don't see any bends or indentions or cracks or anything missing. It's pretty light. I mean, it's not like feather light, but still, it's a lot lighter than uh, my other fixtures that I bought. Here's a little indention, but it's not bad. You can't really even tell it's there. So, okay. That's the T5 lighting. Set this to the side. All right, glass. We got some bulbs from uh, Ball Creek Supply. 
And that uh, fixture, that was also from uh, Amazon. Let's hope they gave us the right bulb. This is for bulb resupply. Okay. And of course, ATI. Look how, look how this nicely packaged. It's got these uh, custom like foam inserts that the lights fit right into. So that's pretty cool. Really can't even get them off. But uh, two blue pluses. Another blue plus and a coral plus right here. And we got aqua blue special and a purple plus. So that's what I'm gonna run in that fixture. All of our ATIs, 48 inches, 54 watts. So this is the rest of the shipment that came. And let's see what's in there. We have uh, Ecotech MP40 covers. There's uh, three of them in here. We've got a uh, Triton test. Since I'm running a Triton, I need a Triton test. That's what that's all that's in here. This big box here. A lot of packing material. <laughs> Alright, we've got two fish nets here. Uh, these are eight inches. Since I'm starting a new tank, I might as well use a uh, brand new fish net, and this is pretty pretty good one. It, it's not like the uh, cheap spiraled metal ones that, that bend so easy. These are pretty sturdy. So, got two of these. These were like a uh, buck fifty each or something like that. Two dollars each. And last on this one is uh, Marine Pier balls. This is the gallon uh, size box and if you're ever wondering about getting this versus the eight inch by eight inch by four inch plate. This thing is packed. So this is probably roughly, you know, it's not the same as eight inch, eight inch by four inch, you know, the big plate, but it's pretty close. The, these balls are, you know, they're, they're packed in here. So uh, this one here, oh yeah. Uh, not really gonna be able to pick this up, but I've got 40 pounds of sand in this box here. Uh, Caribbean Sea Aragonite dry sand, and I picked this up for about 37 bucks for 40 pounds of it. It's dry sand. Uh, it's a special grade. So, and right below that is another 40 pound bag of sand. So I got 80 pounds total. It's going to go in my 85 gallon tank. Probably today or tomorrow, sometime soon. And the last box here, we have the Hannah. Uh, phosphorus checker. Since my phosphates are super low and uh, my, my uh, phosphate checker always reads zero, it reads in parts per billion. This one reads in parts per billion, so I'm hoping to get a better number with this. Do a couple calculations and you should be able to get what it is, your parts per million. So it's going to be a little bit more accurate than the phosphate checker. Once again, that's the phosphorus checker. And last, to complete my Black Friday purchases. I've got the Neptune APK or ATK. I'm sorry, it's the uh, Auto Top Off Kit. So that's everything here. Uh, I want to say I spent around four or five hundred bucks total, which is not bad for everything I got. You know, lights, pumps, uh, bulbs. Uh, you know, all this stuff you just saw here. So it's a pretty good deal. Oh, and, and the flipper magnet. So. That's it for now, guys. I uh, appreciate you guys watching, and uh, have a happy Thanksgiving, and I hope you got a ton of good Black Friday deals and a lot of reef and stuff. Post below what you got for Black Friday, and just let me know. And now for the tank. So 
Uh, it's 85 gallons, like you saw in the last video, where I was uh, cleaning it up and spray painting it and doing all that good stuff. So now everything is spray painted. I uh, installed the overflow tower. The uh, plumbing is complete on the overflow tower. I've actually got water in it right now, doing like a, uh, you know, testing it if it leaks, because uh, I siliconed it. Uh, about four days ago. So I'm going to wait till this next Friday, which is the day after Thanksgiving, to go ahead and add water to it, start adding my rocks and uh, adding a couple fish in there. Um, the sump, as you can see, is my 50 gallon. It's custom built by uh, uh, Lone Star Reef, and it's got the uh, little Texas symbol right in there. So that's pretty cool, Texas State. Um, this stand kind of went over a pretty big overhaul. Uh, this thing's just hanging down, so I'm not too worried about it, but I'm going to remove it. Everything's, all the plumbing's done with that. Uh, all I'm basically waiting on is the silicone to dry, and then this tank will be filled up, hang the lights over it, and uh, she's going to be ready to go. So.